Hello and welcome to Word 52 at Glad Tidings Church. I'm Pastor Tim and want to welcome you to week 32 of 52 weeks where we are memorizing a verse of scripture every week in the year 2019. This week, our verse is found in the book of Colossians chapter 3 and verse 23, where the Apostle Paul says, Whatever you do, work at it with all your heart as working for the Lord, not for human masters. There was a tremendous minister who had a worldwide ministry. But because of a failure in his life, he lost that ministry and was sentenced to jail for a quite a bit of time. It's interesting that his job was to clean the restrooms in the prison facility. So he had gone from being in front of cameras to being in a place where it was least likely desired. And so now he has to clean these restrooms. But the Holy Spirit spoke to him and said, I placed you here to learn. And so he said, Lord, I'm going to clean these facilities as if I was cleaning them for you. And as a result of that, some of the other inmates began to remark about how nice the facilities were. He got an opportunity to share Jesus with them. Let me give you an application. There are a lot of people who feel like that in order to really minister for God, you've got to be behind a pulpit, you've got to work in a soup kitchen, you've got to feed people, you've got to help the homeless, you've got to counsel, you've got to make sure you're sharing your faith. Well, let me tell you one of the greatest ways that you can live for Jesus and share the Word is that whatever you're doing, you do it as unto the Lord. You're doing it for, for Him, for His glory, not for human acclaim or acknowledgement, but you're doing it for Him. He gets glory out of that. So I want to encourage you today. You may be in what you might call a dead-end job, probably wondering what the next steps might be for you. Wherever you are, you do that job. Do that for the Lord. He will receive the glory and He will bless you in the midst of it. So that's why Colossians 3.23 says, Whatever you do, work at it with all of your heart as working for the Lord, not just for human masters. That's Word 52, and this is week 32 of Word 52, and we'll see you next week. God bless you. I hope this is one of your best weeks thus far this year. We'll see you next week.